What it do, YouTube? How y'all feeling today, man? It's your boy Steven Vasquez, man. Subscribe to the YouTube channel if you didn't already. It doesn't hurt to click that subscribe, man. If you want to be a part of my journey, all you gotta do is support and subscribe to my YouTube channel because I post bangers daily, you know, reaction content for the viewers who wants to be entertained. And by that being said, man, if you're having a, a motivation day, a blessed day, you know, to be alive and, and do great things with your time, then, you know, um, subscribe to the YouTube channel because, you know, um, I just want to send a positive, you know, thought, you know, to the viewers, to the world, whoever, you know, watched my content. And it doesn't hurt to subscribe because, you know... You never know what you could do to change their life with that one subscribe, man. It could mean a lot, you know, to me, man. I don't care about a uh, uh, flexing. Uh, that materialistic things is not going to mean nothing in the long term. You know what I mean? And, like, you want to do things that you love to do, man. Like, those things, like those designer clothing, uh, wh whatever the, the case may be, you know. In general, you know, things that cost a lot, that, that none of that shit is going to mean a lot. You know, that, that won't last, you know, for an, for an eternity. So, like, all you got to do is subscribe to the YouTube channel, man. And let's get busy and react to Flight React. <laughs> yeah, let's get into the video, man. It's your boy Steve Vasco, man. I post daily, you know, reaction videos, man. I'm a banger when it comes to recording. You know what I mean? Ah! 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 All right, man. All right, man. Please stop showing your face, please. <clears throat> no, it's, you know, attention is one hell of a drug. Bro, why does that place have so many foxes? What the fuck? Oh, that's a real one. Nigga, that's your twin right there, actually. <laughs> no, no, dead ass, though. No, no funny shit, bro. That shit looks just like you, my nigga. Like... You could adopt that, and people would think that y'all look like a fuck you, dumbass bitch. Y and E, I mean G. Yo, this nigga body is built like a fucking stick, dog. Like no cap. <laughs> Yo, you look like a yo yo. You look like one of these fucking uh security guards, doesn't he, bro? Just look at his fucking face, my nigga. Oh my god. <laughs> yo, I swear to God, bro, this nigga really ugly, dog. Very tall white statue <laughs> standing with his arms spread. In a strange twist, you can see one of the arms bend at about a forty-five degree angle, which is strange because we all know that statues can't bend their arms. Now I'm sure that most of you out there will think this is just photoshopped. Is there a wolf inside there? Oh my fucking goodness, bro! This nigga is so. Bro, how do dogs be trained not to jump off that thing? I gotta be careful. You gotta be careful with that. Yeah, that's not the way to do it. I don't think that bulldozer is strong enough. I don't think it's going to work. Just give it up. Wait, isn't there like place in Rome or something? You can't move those buildings. They've been there since like 1703. <laughs> what the hell? Cats talk? Cats fart? No shit, Sherlock. Why you think they got a fucking ass for it? Oh my god. Go give this nigga a book, man. I, I, didn't he not uh, graduate um, from high school, right? <laughs> what the hell? Animals are talking in 2020. Now it's saying no. Oh, yeah, everybody's seen that. How are you be doing that? I can do the same thing, too. I can do them general modes too. <laughs> Very easy. Thought he was doing something. No, it's not easy, man. buddy. Be humble. <laughs> Bro, what the hell is that? Is that a cat? <laughs> what? Nigga, that's a fucking raccoon. That shit look like you do. 
Oh my God! Curry look at Curry. Curry knocked that dude out too, yo. Good job at holding him back. Curry's literally winning ninety percent of these NBA fights, bro. Y'all forget Curry got hands, bro. He almost whipped LeBron, Russell Westbrook. Couple of altercations, bro. When a girl you've been dating for this pleasure suddenly married family. You know how to read? Oh my God! Hey, someone made a post for me. That's what's up. I like that. When school starts, y'all better be on that like crazy. You can just start doing it now. Just plan them anywhere. Just... Yo, Fly React. Um, I think you haven't passed your uh your school uh courses yet. Uh, cause you ain't graduate. <laughs> you yeah, know that ass though, man. You gotta uh, go to class because you you skip I and mean, you actually dropped out. I think so. Go learn about William Shakespeare. His favorite line too. <laughs> City, local town near you. That's kind of lit, yo. Yeah? Hey, I'm gonna be president of the United States if you guys don't know. I just went 45. I went to school to how to be a president. I just didn't have the cameras on every time. What the hell? You wish, buddy. Mommy will never believe what happened. Oh. She got turned into fucking furniture. <laughs> How was there two hands crawling? There was two hands crawling on my screen. That was a filter, actually. No, editing, I'm sorry. Bro, what the hell? What is this dog trying to say? What? When the new shoes were on day. <laughs> Alright, so you got you see him inbound on the ball. This dude just fell to the ground. What are you doing? This is all I have to do. Pause it right there. What are you doing? Um, he's trying, trying to help him up. At this point, he's traveling. He just gone. traveled. Forgot to make the bucket. What an idiot, bro. When it comes to sports, it's like an eat free, eat dog world, if that's the right quote. Bro, what? I can't even be compared to him, bro. My skills is compared to Iverson and Curry, bro. Like, this dude is nowhere near my level. That nigga's trash, yo. That YouTuber is trash, too. He's not Bro, funny. that is crazy. You know what it is? And this would be 1,000. Probably nobody wants to hear it, bro. It's the simplest thing in the world, bro. These players of today are not drinking enough milk, bro. Milk is what makes strong bones. I know milk is not the most, you know. He can't be talking about milk, right? Motherfucker, you need milk in your body, my nigga. Because you fucking skinny as fuck. Like, you can't even get drafted to the fucking uh, the NBA for kids, I think. <laughs> I'm saying tasty thing in the world. But you should realistically, every human being needs to have one full glass of milk every day. You know what I'm saying? Just because you have a bowl of cereal, that's not a full glass. Do you drink that, though, Mr. Uh, Big Man? The fuck is you talking? You shouldn't be talking at all, my nigga. You look like a fucking slice of fucking uh, sausage, my nigga. It's probably like not even half the glass if you're lucky, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, on top of that, you're not about to drink the rest after you finish your cereal, so you're probably drinking teaspoons, if anything, you know? And that's if you eat cereal, you know? And Jordan, he probably was drinking milk so much, you know what I'm saying, bro? It had to have been, bro. That's crazy, bro. Imagine if Jordan got injured, bro. The NBA would have been shaped so much differently, bro. Who oh, man? Is that Bambi? Fuck Yo, bro, tell me they don't fucking look alike, man. Fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck that. You gotta subscribe to the YouTube channel if they do look alike. No cap. No cap, bro. <laughs> My nigga, come on, bro. You can compare them to. You can. <laughs> Six one, bro. No cap. At this point in the game, I was extremely exhausted more than usual. Because... Oh my god, look at Fly. So inspirational, dude. I was about to suffer from heat exhaustion, no cap. The only thing I ate throughout the entire day was Gatorade, you guys. It's about three and I picked... What? How the fuck can you even eat something uh, liquid? What? I previously played a challenge beforehand. What? It's like an MJ flu game. Not to have any sympathy, just saying. Second grade teacher with strong kids chairs. You got Jokic? This nigga's a joke, Oh my bro. gosh. That lucky ass shit. Oh, just pure luck. That was ugly. Don't do that again anyway. Fox! 
And you're talking about you're going to drop me off. What are you talking about? He's not going to let me play him 1v1 until I play like his girl or something with him. And I have to beat his girl 1v1 first. You got faked that by Jockeys? This was you in the highlight this whole time? I remember watching this highlight like one or two times in previous other vids and shit. But, bro, you can't even guard him? In the NBA, I'm instantly ripping that. You obviously see he has nowhere else to... Bro, you can't be talking, my nigga. You have to be one of the worst. Literally, my nigga, you're asking 2K in the game and in the park of real life basketball. Yes. Go butt to the right side. He's not going to go to the left. Why would he go to the left when he has two other people there? He's a big man. He shouldn't even be dribbling. You know what I'm saying? He's rushing to the basket. He should have known he was going to do that. I would have acted like I was going to go right and then have my left hand out. Swipe the ball, then go right around. You have an easy layup, bro. Can you do it's that, Mr. Flight? of the game, man. Yo, Fox, like, bro. My nigga, you yeah, can't not going to look good, bro. I think I really could drop him one. That's all you got to do? That's all I got? I just got to spam the behind the back like 2K. He really fell for that basic move. You let a player like Jockers look like an all-star, man. Oh, my gosh. But hey, man, coming down below as usual, man, what I should react to next on the road to one, two, three, four. Baby, baby. So you can watch that basketball during that time. Mind me, see. But you put me in the, any era, like in the 1930s through, like, I see probably like the 99s, because that's when the NBA started to get a little bit more athletic, athletic and shit. Bro, like, I'm averaging 30, 40 plus points a game, bro, with ease, bro. Going out as a legend, great in history. You know what I'm saying? Breaking all types of scoring records, bro. Like, look at the way these dudes played back in the day with, like, no um, color in the television and everything, bro. They have, like, no coordination. It's like they weren't even supposed to be playing basketball. It's just like their parents told them to play basketball so they can get a free college offer and, and shit like that. Like, you can tell. You know what I'm saying? But me, it's just, I have God given natural talent, you know? So. It's, He's a fucking price or some shit? Fuck you. What are you, a fucking NBA reporter? Like, Tommy is literally the only reason, like, the Grizzlies are relevant right now, bro. Or if they're even in playoff position. Like, Tommy's been carrying the Grizzlies since he's got to that team, bro. All right, I'm going to go ahead and say it. I'm going to go ahead and say it. I don't care what you got to say. All I do is ask for the city of, uh, or state of Portland. Portland's a state, right? Yes, that's what I thought. Uh, the state of Portland. Um... I don't care, uh, but the Blazers are officially my second team. The Warriors are still my number one team. I'm still a Warriors fan at heart. You know what I'm saying? Still my number one team, but the Blazers are my second favorite team. And the reason is because of Damian Lillard. And I have all rights to say I'm a Damian Lillard fanboy because I was always supporting Lillard since he came out of college. Uh, since And if you were a real fan of me, you would know that I was always a Damian Lillard fan just as much as Curry. If you pay attention to my old NBA Live videos, I used to like upload like NBA Live videos like on this channel before it like died out and stuff. As an NBA, you know what I'm saying, high knowledgeable um, analyst and fan, it's really getting ridiculous how the All-Stars, you know what I'm saying, weekend is getting voted. Like, I don't know who is finalizing these votes, but we had the East Pool of the Reserves um, for the 2020 All-Star game this year, all right? Now, something I'm really upset about is I see like two, three players on here that I have never heard about before. Let's start off with this guy right here, Chris Middleton. I honestly have never heard of this dude until the other night since he, he scored like 50 plus points. Congratulations to him, but he will never be in the Hall of Fame, bro. Look, look, keep doing your thing, and I'm not trying to discourage anybody from this. You know, I'm allowed to voice my own opinion, but Chris Middleton, bro, does anybody own anything? Does anybody even follow you on social media, bro? Like, bam, ab, bop. Bro, you can't be talking about NBA players. You can't be talking about who's going to be in the, who don't deserve the Hall of Fame. But my nigga, you, you deserve to be in the Hall of Fame of the ugliness nigga I've ever seen in the fucking earth. <laughs> like, like I'm, I'm dead serious, my nigga. You like a fucking shape of a fucking caterpillar, my nigga. You know them niggas that be the little the little uh, bugs that be fucking uh, crawling in the ground. Yes, you like one of those fucking insects, my nigga. No cap. You just so fucking ugly. Bio. Jeez. All right, man. Look, I'm about to just end this video off, bro. <laughs> like, did they just recruit this guy? Like, mm. this, bro, I feel like this dude right here is sitting on a a three game contract right now, bro. I've never heard of this dude before. You know what I'm saying? 
where's people like, you know what I'm saying? All right, we're in the East pool because I feel like what I was about to say was the West, so I stopped myself. Kyle Lowry's cool. Ben Simmons, as much as I don't appreciate and like his game at all because he's a clown, he deserves to be in there. Jason Tatum deserves to be in there. Jimmy Butler deserves to be in there. DeMontis Sabonis. Bro, like, is this a joke right now, bro? Like, where's look at my mouse right here. One, two, three. I have never heard of these dudes before in my life, bro. Fuck, he just be throwing some crazy shit, bro, I swear. trying to hit um at your sister or whatever mm. Mm-mm. not this fucking two pick body building ass nigga not him though come on let him do that God, give him this nigga a glass of milk. Jeez. I'm trying to tell you, like, I've, it's not just one time. I've literally forgotten to put my phone in the air. I have multiple phones. I forgot to put one of them on airplane mode, and none of them came in front of me about it. Does this, this happen to anybody? I don't know. Mm. Four positives, you do a negative. <laughs> Bro, like, look at the face. You got, like, Piece, bro, this is like the Pangea. You, you remember when the, the entire universe, at one point, if you pay attention in class, it was called the Pangea back in the day. This is the one thing that I only remember when I used to uh, be in school and I had like a history class. This thing called the Pangea, right? Like that means like America, Brazil, and Europe, and Asia, and Africa. They was all together on one big ass content, bro. This is exactly what his head looks like right now, bro. You know what I'm saying? This bro, is how did this happen, man? Does, does this nigga even be hearing what he be saying before he, he talks? Because I'm fucking lost, my nigga. Like, what the fuck is he talking about? You better just get a chainsaw, bro. Probably a butter knife. <laughs> this is getting out of hand, bro. They made Trey Young go out sad, bro. <laughs> I don't care if you made the next first shot, bro. Trey, you gotta defend yourself, bro. You're a rookie. You're second year in the NBA, bro. Yo, guys, subscribe to the YouTube channel, man. <clears throat> Larry, yeah, you know, he he needs to uh, uh, gain my nigga, because he, he's too skinny, bro, to be even. I don't know how, how I don't even know how many uh, meals per day he be eating, my nigga, because something ain't working, bro. <laughs> subscribe to the YouTube channel, man. It's your boy, Steve Rackle. You want to be a part of the joint journey? All you have to do is subscribe. It doesn't cost. Not even a penny. <laughs>